messing with Bone's sense of orientation. Get rid of the heavy stuff first. Yeah, he's, he's got a point. Probably okay. should get rid of the 24s. Passing through Angels, 16 now. A 15, rather. Your feet dry yet? Leveling off will be feet dry in uh, about 20 seconds. Roger, I'm taxiing. <laughs> I actually set up for computer pilot drop, which is CCIP, basically. Okay. Is it more accurate if you do it back there with CCRP? To be honest, every time I try CCRP, I don't get as accurate results as I do with CCIP. Really? And I've asked in the forums, and a lot of people kind of agree that this just doesn't seem as accurate. So, for better results, I just stick with CCIP. Interesting. Nope, I'm going the wrong way. Yeah, you gotta go east. I thought I was heading east. There's no line. Nope. She's fast. Very, very fast. Like, this thing's like flying my 98 Buick. It, you don't even realize it and you're doing 60. You know? You're barely touching the pedal and the thing just zooms. So should I go air to ground mode, yeah? It's air to ground mode, and your weapon select switch should be off. Yep, it is set to off. Okay, so in your HUD it should say ORD in like one or two seconds. Yep, says that. Okay. It's crossed out the... Uh, oh yeah, master arm, master arm on. On. There we, There we go. And I got a fall line. Okay. So yeah, your C CIP will be a cross on that fall line eventually. We check the lane turn again, so she's rolled up. Yeah, still not ready. But are you targeting something that already? You're not targeting something, are you? No, I was. I was gonna try putting in a fixed point for where the target was, but I okay. interrupted myself. But right. you know where the target is anyway. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm working my way down there. Hammer, you're ahead of us. Yep. I'm going to bring it, uh, let's see, 20 degrees to the left here.
five minutes since we've launched, so maybe it is a seven minute one. Hmm. Well, we got the time because the target's kind of far away. Yep. That's one of the things I was mentioning for was like, well, if we have some flight time, we'll just warm up on the way. I like when it's in single player mode because then I can just time accelerate it so you don't have to wait as long. Right. I don't do anything in DCS acceleration. It just, it would, I mean, it takes so long as it is. I mean, if I do have the rare occasion to play like a F-18 mission single player, it, I'm, I'm going to time accelerate half of it. Yeah, especially for us in real lifers who don't have all that much time to sit around and make ourselves all over. Yeah. Yeah, it's just too long. I'll time accelerate, stop, refuel, time accelerate to target, attack, fight my way out, time accelerate back to tanker, refuel, time accelerate to carrier land. Hey, Okay. Nails Big Bird to o'clock. It's in our threat zone. Is there a JTAC lazing or are we lazing ourselves? JTAC. Oh, okay. I don't suppose you could practice you could practice setting up the coordinating anyways. It'll either ride in on our laser or ride in on the, the JTACs, it won't matter. As long as I can see the target, I can have it ride in our laser. Oh, well, the one thing that would be a problem is if the JTAC is targeting something different. Right. Like that time when there's an SA-10 and it's like, hey, I'll target this truck instead. That's <laughs> right. Okay, so we're passing over Taff and Taz Airport, just below us. So we're nearly there. Is the airport directly ahead of us? Or underneath us? Angel 17.8. You should see smoke on target. Oh, right. Looking. I'm also looking for you. AAA is spiking us. Just AAA? Okay, I got the jammer on. Do you have labels off or something? Dots? Yeah. 
You got dots on, right? Yes, dots are on. Whoa, I got hit by something, I think. Got to adjust our course. Sure oh, there, I got smoke. Eleven o'clock. Eleven o'clock. Okay. I got hit by something. Watch it. There's Sam somewhere. Okay. Yeah, I got nails. Uh, spike a uh, SA19. Jammers running. Hopefully they don't. Got to climb to Angels 23, 24. We'll stay at Angels 24. You see the smoke? Bones. 11 o'clock, you say? 11 o'clock low. No, give me about. Oh, wait, there's red smoke, correct? Red smoke, uh, 10 30 low. Bones, you see the smoke? 11 o'clock low. Yeah, for some reason my team's just angry. Yeah, I have the smoke. Okay. Let's see if I can do me a favor, turn towards it, and kind of put your nose on it. It'll help me be able to find the lantern quicker. All right, we're gonna fly right over it. All right, let's, let's roll past, get some distance between us and then we'll come back. You know, okay. no sense rushing it. All right, we'll come back around towards the ocean and. Uh, I'll come on a right-hand turn so that the lantern is, is catching. I think the lantern's on the right-hand side. That's right. Multiple fires to our right. I got green smoke at... Um, now you know how to drop. I got green smoke at... Or three o'clock. Not sure what the green smoke is about. Yeah, I see it too. I don't know. You know how to drop? How no idea. The lantern. Okay. Um, After the lantern, I, I somewhat. No, go, run me through it. Run me through it. Okay. When I designate a target on the right side of the lantern, you see a vertical scale with a bar coming down it. That's our are timed at the drop point. So when it reaches the mark at the bottom, that's the time to drop. But I would talk you through that anyway. The important thing for you is at the top center of the lantern screen, there will be a, a, like a heading. Okay. And if that's to guide you to the target. So if it's zero, you're heading straight towards the target. If it says like 20 left, then you have to turn 20 degrees to the left, and vice versa for the right. It's just to help you line up. So okay. your job will be to try to keep that at zero the whole time. I'll talk you into when you make the drop. Now remember to use the thumb button when you drop. A lot of people, myself included at first, pull the trigger, and it's like, okay, check, and here, because the gun right. is Yeah, you use the thumb and hold it down. And the last thing to remember is to manually put your, bomb, your wings in, in bomb mode. Oh, oh, stabilize things. Alright, selecting bomb mode now. Okay. And if you want even more help, turn on your SAS switches on. Turn all the autopilot settings on. And then that way when you like nose down, it will hold you steady. You won't, you won't have to worry about trimming so much. Got it. Alright, SAS is on, autopilot's on. Yeah, so you should have a AC ref on the left side of your VDI. I'm not so, seeing the smoke, I think maybe we lost. Yeah, I was gonna say. Did you see? But we just basically went one direction away from it, right? So if we do a U, we should come back to it. Yes. Okay. So, yeah. We probably have a good range ahead of us. I know why Team Secret was acting up. Because I have my hotel set for Lantern right now and I didn't keybind anything with Team Speak on it. So I'm hitting the actual key on the keyboard. 
Hey Hammer, can we request smoke again? Yeah. Lost orientation and I don't have coordinates punched in. Should have it. Okay, our nine o'clock. I'm gonna swing her right here and uh, let you get a lantern on that. Do you have something picked out already? Yeah, we're set with that GB24. No, I mean a target. Do you have a target picked out already? Uh, no, I'm not until I see smoke. Alright, smoke, you're 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock. Uh, turn uh, make that. Sorry. I said I apologize. 3 o'clock. 3 o'clock. 3 o'clock now. Make that 2 o'clock now. 2 o'clock. 2 o'clock. 2 o'clock. Going 2 to 3. Is it in that city? Like a little city? Yeah, it's a little city. Right. Uh, Surrounded by and, field. Farm yeah. Field. Okay. Yeah. Try to put your nose on him. It'll make it a lot easier for me to get him in the lane. Okay. Turning us into it. Alright, I'm nose on. Roger. S steady. Okay, see the city, I'm gonna go for smoke. Just kind of orbit. I'm sure that's the right city. You might need to move a little further up. This one? Or maybe that one? Yeah, it's, it's really small. Let me take a look. Alright, we're going to pass over it in like 10 seconds. So it should be like near, near really close to us at this point. It's at your 11 o'clock low. Yeah, I think you were just on it. Right, go to the right a little bit. To the right of those. On top of it right now. Yeah, so it should be directly underneath us. Alright, this is directly beneath us right now. This view. We're probably overshot it. I'm going to point our nose right at the target in, in a dive so you can see it. We want to come down on that. Okay, I got the flight path marker right on it right now. That This is the city. There's the smoke. Yep, okay, pulling up. Designator just got fine tuned.
What's your altitude? 20. 21. Uh, Climbing. Alright, what are we looking for? Anything. Okay. Uh, you can also use the JTAC, right? You can just drop if you want. Let me see if I see anything first. Oh, there is something right there. Stand by. Must be a vehicle. Yeah, it looks like. What is that? I can't make out what it is. It's a truck of some kind. It looks like a vehicle. Alright, have smoke in sight. Okay, well, we're designated so. It's not a look on the screen again. Okay. So, um, we're heading 089 right now. No, we're 270. Uh, okay. Yeah, 270. Alright, if you look under the bottom right, we'll see where it says 089. And the next one says 5.2. Uh, I got in the bottom right of the VDI television screen. The I one got, showing the, the lantern screen, yeah. Right, I got 090, right. 6.6 6 okay. miles. 090 is your bearing to target, 7.2 and climbing is our range, so we're flying away from it. So turn ahead of 090. I think you lost the target. That's right, it's... I have it designated. Alright, turn it back in. Yeah, once we, um, Head back 090, I can be designated. That's one thing nice about this lantern, once you designate it, it remembers it, you can just snap right to it. Okay. Yep. Okay. And your wings are bomb mode? They're going to be. Okay. Alright, here's 090. Yep, steadying up on 090. Okay. Alright, okay, so we got about one minute. Or, tw sorry, 25 seconds to drop. When I, do I go into a dive for it, or am I going to just drop straight? Um, it's best for you to CCIP it, but you don't have to. 10 seconds to drop. 8, okay. 7, 6, 5, 4, Magnum. 3, 2, 1. Check. Nice job. Release. Breaking left. Release. Copy Give me a slight right hand climbing turn, very slight. Nose up five degrees, right hand turn. Slight rudder. Six seconds of impact. Come on, baby. No, it should have hit. You may have missed. I think um we might have been off axis. I noticed, you know, at the top see right at the top of the screen it says R125. At the top of the screen I got 135 now. Okay, underneath that, under the horizontal line, it's hard to see because it's here to me. Yeah, all right, I got 130. There, yeah, see, so it says R130. That means you have yeah. to turn right 130 degrees to run in directly on it. And when we ran in, we were coming kind of fast, it's at right 89. Alright, all four of my So uh, it was a little pop, so... Okay, Understood. so I'll, we'll go back and try There's to There's an SA-6 in the town there. Right, that Understood. Music's still running. Okay, so our bearing back is 299 or I don't think I can get him. He's in the buildings. 299 are for 7 miles. Roger it. It just says, uh, say again. Wings are in bomb mode. Should I go into a dive this time? Uh, wait until we get on, uh, of course. Okay, a little bit more. Okay, so it's 30 degrees to the right. Three, three, four. Oh, so I, you still got to bring it more? 
Yeah, okay, now, good, it's coming down. 25 degrees, keep coming. S start steady up, steady up. Steady up. Hold heading right here. Okay, right, 17 right seconds to drop, you ready? Yep. Yeah. Oh wait, hang on, hang on, I know we're too close. We're 1.4 miles out, we missed the drop point, that's okay. Extend. Okay. And we'll try it again. I have it designated, so we'll just come back. Okay. When we get to about six miles away, that's mm -hmm. usually where I personally start to turn back on heading. And that's okay. usually enough time to be able to get over target and drop. All right. So if you want, put your wings in auto. And then give us an afterburner so we can get to six miles quickly. Okay. So exciting, your first drop. Yep. Five miles. Right, just five miles. And there's six ones if you want. Throw us idle. And give us a UE. 163 is the bearing. I'm a little... Okay, you're 9 degrees to the right. There you go. Hold steady right there. Whoop. Low left. Low to the left. Hold steady. Hold 175 heading. Okay. Okay. When he's in bottom. 9, 8, 7. Oops. Stabilize. Why is this holding at 9? Okay, 8, 7. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, that's quite Check. Good. Was that really? Laser's oh. running. Did it drop? Yes, it did. I don't know. Good job. It's a good drop. No, I think that was you. Two seconds of impact. Good kill. Good kill. Haha, <laughs> it's a tank. Make nice. It Congratulations, you just popped your cherry. <laughs> yeah, apparently we got hit by something though. Yeah, I heard that. Missile, missile, missile. That Sam is, is firing, he's hot. Another missile, another missile. Chop, chop, chop. Right. I think you're going down. I'm killing the jammer. We have control? Yeah, we got control. Okay, good. Not yeah, let's sure. just evade for now. Take a look back there. Are we on fire? Uh, we're smoking. Fire, fire. You are smoking. But I don't know. Do you have a fire warning light on the right fire? Give you to the away. right of your screen? Nope. No. Okay, so we're not on fire. We're probably just leaking oil or something. Let me check my warning lights here. It's yeah. black smoke. Oh, wow. The damage display is lit up like a Christmas tree. I have no warnings in the back here. Right inlet, right ramp, right generator, oil pressure, hydraulic pressure, right fuel pressure. Okay, be a good time to bug out. <laughs> well, I guess that, that dive got the job done, but not good for the plane. Let me see what we got around us for airports. Uh, tap, tap and Tanaz, Tap Tanaz might be an option. You've got to go to Turkey, or you're going to land in an enemy airport. Which way is Turkey? North? West. Northwest. Okay, how about... Hatay? Hatay, yeah, I'm gonna try to make for that. Somewhat of a short runway, but I think you could probably do that. I knew if we dove in, I was gonna get hit. I just, I just knew it. And when we pulled out, I was like, okay, cool, we didn't get hit, and the bomb hit, that's awesome. And then I turn around to look at you, Bones, and I see that the back wing is on fire. <laughs> Alright, let me tune this VR in. GBU away. 
just gonna pepper these guys with GPU 12s. Just to uh, stroke your ego some, I'm reading the text. One hundred arrow. The log. Blue player yeah. after an F14B killed red unknown in T90 with GPU 24. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, you guys definitely got it. Bombcat. Nice job, Bones. I killed an unknown unknown. Thank you. Oh. Dick Cheney would be happy with that. <laughs> the unknown unknown. <laughs> if you want, we could practice jumping the rest of our ordnance on some civilian targets. <laughs> no, but I, I'm thinking actually emergency procedure, shouldn't we jettison? Oh, if you wish. Oh, no. You set it up. <laughs> How is the fuel? 10,500. Okay, we can just tanks too. Well, let's hold on to the tanks okay. for now. Just in case. I mean,. That'd be classic, we try to send the tanks and then immediately I lose, I start leaking fuel or something. Yeah. Okay, I just sent everything but the pylons, the missile pylons and the fuel tanks. And we are missing a right <laughs> shield It's amazing the JTAC doesn't turn on Sam's first. No. Yeah, that is amazing. But we did just get a Shilka. Nice. nice. I'm gonna jettison the business too. Yeah. Yeah, go ahead. Alright, good time for me to call up some red air. <laughs> <laughs> we still have a gun. I can't jettison that. Shot all its missiles at you, it's not targeting me at all. Got another unknown, unknown. Sweet. And for the and the autopilot, we be in a hard right barrel roll, spiraling towards our deaths right now. So, um, we probably actually didn't necessarily need to dive down that target because since I'm in the back working the laser, we could have acted like it was CCRP. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, because once we drop it, you know, I'm just getting it with laser. So, my fault for not mentioning that. Yeah, you can probably just. It's just, it is a little more accurate with your nose on it. You know, because of the CCIB uh -huh. cross. But since I am back here guiding it, you totally could have just flown straight and level and dropped it, and I would have guided it. So no, we wouldn't have been damaged. Yeah, we definitely wouldn't have been damaged if that were the case. I assume the reason why we missed the first time, I assume the reason why we missed the first time was because I did fly a straight path, and it just prefers if you dive in. GB away. Any sense as to why we missed the first time? Was that the reason, or no? Well, the last um, steering cue that I saw that before we dropped was right 90. So I think we actually had the designation right off of our wing. And so when it dropped, it couldn't swing over quick enough. All right, so we were we were off target, in other yeah, words. Yeah, yeah. But hey, hey, we're... Nice. Yeah. You're becoming a real kill machine in that Mirage. This is a Harrier. Oh, you're in the Harrier. Dude, hey, I've got the only a... thing that can truck with all the bombs. Yeah, I was going to say, that thing has a lot of bombs on it. Alright, if you hold a, a heading of 300, we're 32 miles from home plate. I can carry 10 the... GBU-12s. Wait, when you say the ca home plate, you mean the carrier? No, I, I, whatever is designated here is in 
her flight computer's home base, which I'm assuming is that airfield because it's exactly where we're headed. Okay. So it must have been pre-programmed in our flight computer that that's our home base. Hi, all right. From airfield or carrier? From the carrier. That should be your home base then. Yeah, I got the airfield right below us, so I think that's oh, the yeah. carrier. Oh, okay. yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. We're yeah. not fit to land on the carrier. No, no. I'm sick, yeah. It would be right between us and the carrier, exactly. So GBU away. Winchester heading home. Yeah. Let's see if I can dial up the, uh, the radio. I'll get that. Alright, it's, uh... 128.5, got it. Right, okay. Is that in your back seat or is that up here? It's back here. I've got a truck and another unknown unknown. Yeah, I'm getting pretty good in the Harrier here. Yeah, I can see that. You also are really showing your hatred for unknown unknowns. I just don't like it. Extreme prejudice. Inbound. Zero nine five one zero three two eight six point five two zero point one. You guys are at Hatai, you looking to land there? Yeah, I'm just, yeah. I'm just you know, it's getting doing ready that to turn around where when I tune it, it brings it to guard. Uh. Why don't you try your radio in front? The frequency okay. is... Okay. Yeah, no See if you can tune two five zero decimal one five zero. You two five zero decimal what again? One five zero. Yeah, it was in high stereo there. Okay, so you got your cards. Okay, check wings wings are in auto mode. Yeah, they are. All sand okay. switches are on. Oh, dude, we we would have crashed by now if they weren't. Okay. And you're in landing mode? Not quite yet. Okay. I'm just trying to use every system I can to help us land since we're missing a right stabilator. How's your roll? It's starting to drift. It's starting to roll a little bit to the right. Okay. The, uh, you have enough trim left? Landing, landing. Haven't used any trim, so. Yeah, I might want to try left trimming since we're missing that stab. Flaps down. I have the runway. Roger. Ford, one, one. Request landing. To me, you guys still look full of bombs. You didn't drop your uh, 16s. No, I jettisoned everything. Oh, it's For me, at least. Air brake on? No, not yet. Pop the air brake on. It helps with the engine performance. That's why the air brakes are on all the way through the landing cycle. In okay, good air brake. Interesting. Yes. We're probably approaching from the wrong direction. SK, this is emergency. Yeah. 
What's your heading? Uh, uh, we are heading uh, zero, zero, four, zero. 0 DLC on? Yeah, that's Pop DLC. Okay, it's on. Okay, good, we're a little high, that's okay. Rather a little high than a little low. Yeah. 170 knots. So you can slow it down some more. Throwback. 160 knots. There you go. Careful with the brakes. Okay, we're just gonna glide in. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I don't understand why it hey, starts. Hey, it's a shortcut to the ramp. Yeah. I don't understand why it does that. Like, I, I started applying both brakes. Oh, hey, I Tay, did. we are in the parking area. Oh, I, nice. I, Place landing. Yeah, I'll take it. But I, I applied the brakes, and all of a sudden, you know, at the same time, the toe brakes, and all of a sudden it starts to drift to the right or left and takes me off the runway, invariably. Are you putting a little rudder input in? Well, I might be. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. But these rudder pedals suck. Yeah. Hey, oh, I, I think we're missing a wing now. Yeah. yeah. Right, right. It's fine. <laughs> but the landing gear didn't drop out. I mean, we didn't land on top of the gas tank, so we're okay. That's true. Didn't crush the fiberglass tanks. Alright, retract your air brake. Raise your flap. Notice I said flap, not flaps. <laughs> Alright, so next time, just be on course and we can fly straight and I don't have to dive in on the target and get us killed. Right. Although right. it's absolutely cool. Oh, hey, it, we did got look, our it did look pretty cool. <laughs> I gotta admit, it did look pretty cool. Right up to the part where I looked behind us and saw that we were on fire. I didn't hear the impact of the missile either. I heard a, a clank. I thought it actually got shot with a 20 millimeter, 30 millimeter. Alright, man, I, I, I gotta call it a night. Sounds good. Nice job. Nice job. Good teamwork. Yeah, yeah, next one yeah. will be even more better. That was, I think, the most success you guys have had in the 14th.